everybody. Welcome back to another episode of The Fogo Life. And today, we're gonna be making something that we've all had in our freezer at one point or another, frozen pizza. But we're not doing it the usual way. We're gonna be making it on the big green egg. And guess what? No pizza stone required. So you might be thinking, why frozen pizza on the egg? You could just do it in the oven, right? Right? Well, it's hurricane season here in Florida, and we never know when a storm's gonna hit. We can always rely on the big green egg when the power goes out and things go rough. First, we're gonna get started by filling our big green egg with some Fogo Premium Charcoal. If you can see, I'm not adding too much charcoal. We already had quite a bit from our last cook in the grill, so we're just gonna go ahead and use mostly what we already had. I went ahead and put a blazer ball in with two of our Fogo Fire Starters. We're gonna go ahead and light that up now. I'm gonna go ahead and add in a Smoke Your Bourbon Bourbon Barrel Block. The blocks are made from authentic bourbon barrels. I'm gonna go ahead and throw one on top just to bring out that smoky flavor in our crust. So I went ahead and threw on our plate and our grate. We're gonna cook it indirect. We're gonna let it climb up to 400. Our grill has come up to temperature and we are ready to throw on our frozen pizza. So I chose Red Baron's pepperoni pizza today. We chose the brick oven style, as you can kind of tell. We're gonna throw it straight onto the grill grate. That's right, you heard me. We're putting our frozen pizza right onto the grill gate. We're gonna go ahead, close that. We're gonna let our pizza cook for about 18 minutes. Uh, we just want our cheese to melt and our crust to get nice and golden. It's gonna get really crispy, a lot crispier than if we just did it in the oven. And remember, we want a crispy crust, not a burnt crust. Nobody likes a burnt crust, but we all like crispy. So keep making sure that you're adjusting your vents to maintain that 400 degree temperature. Do, 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 do. It's been about 18 minutes. Let's go ahead and check on how our frozen pizza is doing. Oh my goodness, it looks so crispy and it smells so good. So far, it looks like the best frozen pizza I've ever had. Hopefully the taste matches up. Now that we're all sliced up, and it smells so good, looks like somebody just woke up at the right time. All right, what's all this good stuff I smell cooking out here? Wow, what do we got going on here? I might have used your egg again. Oh boy. But it's okay, because I made you frozen pizza. Frozen pizza, wow. I'll tell you what, look at that. That's a solid crust. That is a solid crust. That's a nice job. Cheers. Cheers. I would say I was right. I think this is the best frozen pizza I've ever had. You know what? I love that it just kind of picked up a little hint of the smokiness and a little bit of the charcoal flavor to it. It actually adds to the pizza. Something I didn't tell you is that I also might have stole one of your barrel proof bourbon blocks and put it in the charcoal. Stole? Borrowed. Uh, borrowed, mm -hmm. what's the difference really? <laughs> Excellent, really good. I'm going back inside to lay down and eat this. Nice job, kid. Enjoy. See that? No pizza stone, no problem. Making the frozen pizza on the big green egg is just as easy, if not easier, than doing it in the oven. Even though you don't have the pizza stone to give you that crunchy texture, this actually might be the crunchiest frozen pizza I've ever had. We'll see you next time on The Fogo Life. Kick and Kate, out.